at his first three career playoff starts. He's also one of four players in the Super Bowl era with a 75-plus completion percentage and back-to-back -back playoff starts. Foles has had a career punctuated by inconsistency, but he's played well in the postseason. Foles on what he'll be feeling when he takes the field on Sunday. I don't know what the feelings will be like. I know at that moment it'll be, you know, it's the you know, Super Bowl. So uh, I know the, the only time I'll feel it are in that moment. So I'm excited to just run out of the tunnel with my teammates, Super Bowl Sunday, and play that game. Um, I have no idea what I'll feel. I know it'll be a lot of excitement, but uh, I look forward to that moment. The big thing is you try to just simplify what's going on in your mind and slow it all down. And that's just in anything you do. If you can slow everything down and just have simple thoughts and just see everything more clearly, you make better decisions, you play faster. Um, and for me, I'm just a, a much better player in those situations. And, you know, the word that comes is chill. Well, we have an update on Steelers linebacker Ryan Shazier, and it is a good one. He posted this photo on the gram of him and Ben Roethlisberger. Shazier discharged from the University of Pittsburgh Medical Center Rehabilitation Facility. He had spinal stabilization surgery on December 6th. And so keep it here on NFL Network as we continue to give you updates on his condition. We just hope for a full recovery for him. But, Kay, as we send it back to you, J.J. Watt, Eli Manning, and then Melvin Ingram for crying out loud. This is like a murder's yeah. row of guests here on this program. Yeah. And we have all the ice in all of Minnesota on the neck of our next guest. <laughs> nice. Ingram joining us here at the NFL Experience. Great stuff with Will Selva. We are back here. Oh. Okay. For Melvin, okay, yeah, okay. yeah, we're here for it right now. Uh, we know that you love music. Tell us about it uh, and this. It's my, it's one of my passions, really. I, I feel the same way about music how I feel about football. I do that in my free time. Every free time I get, I'm studying my playbook and doing music. Love that. Yeah. Now you had your best year of your career under new defensive coordinator Gus Bradley, one of my former head coaches. What clicked for you this year, going to the Pro Bowl and being a dominant force out there? Uh, I think I think Gus just more of let us let us be us. Mm. He he tell you just make plays. He all about making plays, really. He don't want you to just stay blocked or do that. Mm. He wants you to make plays. He say you get paid to make plays. Mm. That's no, awesome. and I I'm just staring, man. I'm staring. I'm staring at the ice. Those are the ice caps. If those melt, the world will flood. That's an incredible and an alien sweater. Did you spin it? Can, may I spin it? Can you spin that? Oh, my God. It's because the jewelry is out of this world. It is. It's out of this world. All right. Black man, it's so dope. Wow. So, Melvin. I want to ask you about Joey Bosa. Okay. I'm going to go out on a limb. I think there might be a bit of a style difference between you two. Huh. Um, <laughs> how do you guys get along as a pass rush duo? What is your relationship like with Bosa? Because we love Bosa uh, here. We got a great relationship, really. I feel like what makes us so good together is because we're so different. Okay. Really, he more of a technician, and I'm, I go more for athletic ability, which, with, which kind of like works hand in hand, really. Because uh -huh. I feel like if we both were technicians, then you got two technicians. Right. But right, we right. got two different styles, so when we switch, it's like you getting two different styles of rushing yeah. all game, so you got a lot to work with. Personality-wise, really. you guys jive? Yeah, definitely. Yeah? definitely. We talk every day. We, we he, he always showing me stuff. I'm always showing him stuff, so that's really like a little brother to me. For yeah. Me. That's I love awesome. Even the way Melvin talks, it's got like a cadence where I want to like does, break huh? it up. That's, <laughs> that's called up. swag. Hey, wait, I don't have it. Um, anyway, two of your college teammates, but also two of your college Roommates yeah. are going head to head in Stephon Gilmore and Alshon Jeffrey this weekend yeah. in Super Bowl. Will you attend the game? And have definitely. you spoken to those guys? Definitely, you're going. Definitely, 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 I wouldn't miss it for the world. And what's it going to be like when they finally, for the first time in their pro careers, go head to head? The in atmosphere, I think, is going to be crazy, man. It's because all of us, we work so hard together, we grind so hard together to get this moment to the NFL, and then they going against each other on the biggest stage. I feel like between them lines, they don't know each other. That's how we build them. Mm. Between them lines, they don't know each other. They going to battle like they don't know each other. But outside, they love each other. So may the best man win. Yo, oh, used to oh. live together. Yeah, it's crazy. Like, we're talking like, 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 like roommates? Like yeah. tough ramen and chili. Like, yeah. 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 exactly. 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 Started from the bottom, now we're here. Exactly. Can I call you Mel? I don't know. I just never thought that I could do that. Melvin Ingram, something Sort of wild happened on the show right. last week. DJ Swearinger was on, and uh, he said this. 
Who's got the biggest arm in the NFL? And we're talking about just straight cannon. Cannon. A guy Melvin can... Ingram has the biggest arm, man. Really? No, no, no. Melvin Ingram can throw, throw the ball. Throwing. Melvin Ingram. Wait, wait, hold on. It's not Paul Bunyan, no. Yeah, he can throw the ball 100 yards. No, stop. Man. Stop for a second. Defensive can end for the Chargers can throw the ball 100, 100 yards. Harder than Aaron Rodgers. Man, he can Tell us about it. Yards. <laughs> College, he would do it all the time. We would, he what? would kill people on bets. <laughs> like, I can throw this ball 100 yards. Uh-huh. <laughs> like, bro, you're not throwing the ball 100 yards. He sat down on one knee and what? threw it like 70. So there it is. Okay, Mike? 100 yards, yeah, 70 definitely. on your knee. Wait, wait, so conf- wait, 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 wait. Time out. <laughs> can you confirm <laughs> that yours. you've thrown 100 yeah, yeah, yards? I can confirm. In real life? <laughs> yes. In real life. A football. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, we're on a field here. Um, no quarterback in the history of the sport has ever thrown the ball 100 yards. You're defensive end. Nobody can throw 80. I'm not a quarterback. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, listen, I should, I'm my four-string quarterback. This is, a, this is a spaceship right here. He's yeah, an alien. I'm okay. a four-string quarterback. Okay, you can so, throw it 100 yards. Yes, definitely. All right, so listen. In my don't... college days, in my college days, okay. I was definitely throwing 100 easy. That is crazy. <laughs> okay. That's like Uncle Rico, <laughs> Rico throwing over the mountain. Oh. Yes. Listen, this is what we're going to do. This is Uncle Fleeco okay. right here. Right? Uncle, okay. Uncle, okay. That was fine right I know. Here. I know. Uncle Fleeco. I know. All right, listen. I know. So, <laughs> what we're going to do, we're going to go back there. We'll sit you over here, oh and you can you can drop to me if you want right. to show how strong your arm is. Cool. The fellas gonna come down here and try to fight for the ball, and we're just gonna All see right, guys, how strong this arm really is. I believe hey, in you. I, believe in you. I want him to break my glasses. Run up, run up on him. <laughs> Let go. Let's 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 go. let us go I don't know what it's like to lose everything I